Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Coffee Talk. I have some coffee already made. I'm here at my apartment. All that fun stuff didn't feel like going to Starbucks, anything like that. I've already recorded another Coffee Talk about another subject, um, brand loyalty. But while I'm sitting down here and enjoying my amazing cup of coffee um, that I wish was Starbucks or whatever, um, I'm on a roll, so let's do this. Um, not that many people know this, or they do, but they just don't care. Um, within Instagram, there's these things called engagement groups, right? I've only been in two engagement groups on my time within Instagram. And um, in my opinion, they're not worth it because engagement groups, the main idea about engagement groups is that you join in, right? And that whoever posts stating that, hey, I have new content up, everyone within the group is supposed to go like share or like comment and if they want to share it as well just so that it could generate engagement so that it could beat the instagram algorithm or whatever the case may be right everyone in the group is supposed to do that show support and all that fun stuff my problem with engagement groups is you have different level of content or quality of content, some is pretty incredible, some is just there like you'd look at it and you're just there like, what the hell is this? <laughs> and then um, just different level of seriousness and who's taking their Instagram content serious, who's not. Um, there's some individuals and in engagement groups that are very, very supportive, do what they need to do, right? And there's some individuals that literally just Oh, I want all the support and then would barely give it back until they get kicked out. So some groups are filled with a whole lot of drama um, and just not not good. Um, so yeah, that's I really do think that engagement groups are not the way to go on Instagram simply because when you're focusing on building your Instagram account, right? Or any social media platform. If you're in a group that's supposed to help generate you more likes, views, comments, whatever the case may be, right? In my opinion, I think that's all fake. You're getting fake likes, you're getting fake comments, you're getting fake engagement. So let's say a company wants to give you a chance they're giving you that chance based off of how many followers you have, your overall aesthetics on your Instagram account. They're basically giving you a chance on your personality and how much engagement, authentic engagement you're having, right? If your engagement is fake and you don't have that follow through with people using your code for whatever company that is, Boom, you just made yourself look like garbage to that brand, to that company. And a lot of brands in any industry that they're in, normally they're in communication with other brands. So let's say you do the right thing, right? And stop using the engagement group, build up an authentic engagement and community for people that you want to talk to. Um, your reputation is already hurt because of what happened last time. So if that old company talks to the new company that is thinking about hiring you on, even though you have real engagement, that person could easily be talking in a negative aspect, stating that you weren't that return of interest or return of investment, ROI. And yeah, so in my opinion, like I said, engagement groups are not the way to go simply because it's just fake engagement, fake likes, fake content. And in all honesty, the energy that you're putting into that engagement group, right? Of making sure to like what people are, are posting, comment, show that engagement to them. You can easily take that effort into your own content, into your own brand, figure out if you wanna do a vlog, a, bigger, uh, a blog, a vlog, videos, if you want to learn videography, editing, 
if you, you could take that energy that you're using towards that engagement group, put it into yourself. And also, I think social media, your feed should be who you want to follow, who you want, who motivates you, what content inspires you. It shouldn't be someone that is just a part of that engagement group that you'll look at their content and just be there like, this does nothing for me, absolutely nothing at all. So I think engagement groups are not the way to go in social media. If you are thinking about doing one, just take my advice, just focus on your own content, your quality of content, upload frequency, just do social media for you, be real, be authentic, and forget engagement groups. They're not worth it. Oh, it's so good. Still wish I had Starbucks though. And that's it. That's that's it for today's coffee talk. Um, thank you so much for checking in regarding me, my general opinion on engagement groups on social media, primarily Instagram. And um, like, share, subscribe, and see you guys in the next video.